Hello, grace you and peace from God our Father and our Lord Jesus Christ. Pastor Mike Salmon here from Harvest Christian Fellowship, and this is a moment in the Word. Today we celebrate what we call Good Friday, the day when Christ was crucified on the cross. In John chapter 12, verse 31 and 32, it says, Now is the judgment of this world. Um, now shall the prince of this world be cast out, and I, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. This he said, signifying what death he should die. And this is of Jesus Christ dying on the cross, that if he's lifted up, he draws all men unto him. So today, as we celebrate Good Friday, we celebrate the death of Jesus Christ, because through the death of Jesus Christ, the body and the blood has cleanses us, has paid the penalty for our sins. Now, in two more days, we're going to celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ, when Christ raises from the dead. And this, this is a, a celebration of new life. Now, for those of you who are attending Harvest Christian Fellowship, you should be fasting. We are fasting from sun up to sundown. So if you're watching this in the morning and you're like, oh, I should be fasting, it's not too late. Fast. Spend some time in prayer. Spend some time in worship. And then what we do is we gather. If you're in Harvest, you're going to be gathering together um, for our uh, Good Supper, Good, uh, Good Friday Supper, where we're going to celebrate the Lord's Supper. We're going to celebrate a time of worship and a time of eating and celebration. But from now until then, fast and seek God's face. Remember what Jesus Christ did for you. He died on the cross for your sins. We call it Good Friday because we are saved because of God's goodness. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. It's through the cross of Jesus Christ we are saved. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you, Lord God. And as we go through this day, Father, let us be reminded of why we are saved because of what you've done for us. You gave us your son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for our sins, to be buried and raised from the dead. It is through the salvation that's found through the cross that we are saved. We thank you, Father God, for everything that you do. Bless us here this day, Father, and bless this time of celebration. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless.